Hey, good day everyone. It's Camp and Cass from Smith RV in Casper, Wyoming. I want to walk you through this 2023 Puma 26 FKDS. So if you're looking for something to maybe, uh, maybe like hosting uh, when you guys all go out camping, maybe like bringing friends over, maybe you like to do the camp cooking. Uh, this front kitchen has got a ton of counter space and all in a very manageable size. This thing is under 30 feet. It comes in dry in the mid 6,000 pound area and grosses out somewhere in the 8,000 pound area. So it's very manageable, not a very big trailer, but there is a ton of storage and a ton of things to offer on this thing. So let's start taking a look here. So we have, and which we'll show you the main portion of this once we get to the inside, but we have some out, outside storage here and this goes into a closet in the bedroom that is also prepped for a washer dryer. So not that you may need one, but it is plumbed, it is ready to go. We have two sets of step above solid steps on this unit. One entrance into the bedroom, one entrance into the kitchen living area. We have a 21 foot awning on this, nice LED light strip, lighted speakers up there of an outside shower, black tank flush on here, and we do have a mount to bring the TV outside if you do wish to do so. We have aluminum wheels. Now this is a great feature. It's got the mini outdoor kitchen on here. This is not standard. This is an optional feature that we've taken, and they have the graystone griddle on this. We have a quick neck port to go to the trailer so you can do all your cooking. You're under the awning and you have your refrigerator right here as well. We have a nice entry door assist handle, our other set of solid steps. And then this trailer does have also uh, power stabilizer jacks on the front and back. So I wanna just demonstrate that a little bit. You can actually see a slight lift in the trailer. So that's gonna really support this thing. So you don't have to do the work. Uh, you're just putting them down and you're gonna start enjoying Okay, so we have our fresh water connection there. Six gallon DSI suburban water heater. A little tip on those, you can turn the gas and electric on at the same time to kind of uh, create a quicker recovery. Coming around the front, you get a good view at the A-frame. Now Forest River has gone to uh, doing powder coated frames on these things. So a real beauty of that is basically that frame is gonna last a lot longer without rusting. So definitely a great coating finish. They also do a real nice job with doing a inset battery rack on here. So we include into all of our deals two uh, deep cycle batteries with that. We're not gonna charge you for one. We're not gonna charge you for two. You're gonna get them. All right, we have two 30 pound propane tanks, power tongue jack. And now this is kind of great. So we have diamond plate on the bottom for the stone protection then wraps into hard siding and then we have a view from a front window that does have a shade on there so you can really bring the outdoors in. All right let's go to the utility side of the coach. I want you to take a quick look under here. So we do have a rack and pinion slide system on this trailer. The most tried, the most true uh, slide systems out there. So we're going to have a little bit of storage that you can access from the inside or the outside, and this goes right under the booth I met. All right, moving back here. So we do have our dump stack here. Gray handle for the gray, black for the black. Now, let's take a quick gander at the underbelly. So all nicely enclosed underbelly on these. It does have the insulation package, so we're enclosed underbelly, it's insulated, and we got a 35,000 BTU furnace that's also putting some heat into that underbelly as well. So 
this will take you deeper into the cold. All right, let's check out more outside storage here. Now this is gonna go under the bed uh, in, in the unit. So vinyl flooring and a lot of space in there. All right, coming around the back side. So a few great features back here. So we have a, this flip down tray that uh, is gonna be awesome to you know, put coolers, put firewood, maybe a grill of some fashion. Um, definitely gonna be awesome. And then it pins down, pins up into place, so nice, solid, fixed. Just for some more options, we do have a rear receiver hitch on this trailer from the factory, so that's gonna be great for maybe uh, doing a bicycle rack or something like that. That's gonna give you some options to bring some accessories along with you. Up top here, it is prepped for a uh, backup camera. Uh, so in the event you do want to put one on here, that's going to give you a lot more visibility back here. All right, guys, let's go check out the end. All right, guys, welcome inside the Puma 26 FKDS. So let's take a look at a few features in here. As I mentioned, this is kind of like a hosting, entertaining, you know, awesome floor plan. So we have theater seating. So theater seating is always good in my mind. And they will fit taller people if you are taller, but they also are good for shorter people. So I'm six foot three, a little taller today with my boots on. We have USB ports right on the side here. And so you want to catch a few Z's, we got our light switches right there as well. So another thing, we're directly across from our entertainment center with that 40 inch flat screen TV, our fireplace that's putting out uh, 5,000 BTUs of heat and our sound bar down here. So we got our booth dinette here. We have storage on each side, storage in here. And then storage in here. And if you remember, this one is accessible from the outside. Love a good booth dinette. Doubles as a sleeping area. So if you got the kids, the grandkids, uh, friends, you know, another place to sleep them. Love the lighting, love the fixtures that they've gone in here. We have solid shades, roller shades in here too. So it's going to really cut the light. So, and again, back to this. You like to maybe be the host, maybe you like to do the cooking. The counter space in this thing is insane. I don't know how many inches that is, but it's it's a whole bunch. It's way more than, than the average trailer. So we have massive counter space. We have a single basin, stainless steel sink. Got a drying rack. This nice little uh, solid wood uh, cutting board. And we have an industrial shower or excuse me an industrial sprayer um, and then these cabinets up here are super deep as well so i don't think you're going to run out of storage here nice little bank of drawers some more storage down here in the bottom and it just like doesn't quit on here i could open doors for a while so and they've chosen to go on with the slightly bigger graystone oven range on here got nice led lights flat cover but this does flip up and that is a nice removable grate as well for easy cleaning and then also a gray stone microwave so we do have a eight cubic foot uh dometic gas electric refrigerator on here as well so we got that and let's check out storage does not stop in this thing it is insane so i don't know we got you know kind of spice racks i would say or canned good items uh could go in here and then an amazing pantry in this thing we have a solar controller because this trailer does have a roof mounted solar panel on board so it's going to keep the batteries fed and full uh keep you camping and enjoying your time all right let's go to the bathroom Okay, come on into the bathroom. We have a little uh, motion sensing uh, night light in here. So you won't be uh, bonking into things. 
in the evenings. We have a nice radius shower, glass doors, great height in here. So this is an 81 inch ceiling height. So taller people, you're going to have plenty of room. My head's not even into the skylight on this thing. So got a little LED light there. Nice little shower head. And I think I'll have enough room to uh, do what I need to do in here. So coming over to our commode, we got a plastic foot flush commode. And then some more storage down below. We have a soap holder, a toothbrush holder, and a nice medicine cabinet. All right, meet me into the bedroom. I'm gonna go through the pass through. So now, welcome to the bedroom. So this is a, got a slide back here. We have a wardrobe in here. So a lot of hanging space. And we have two drawers for folding clothes. So, and then into our massive closet so again we got a great closet maybe maybe you could hang more clothes maybe store some things we are prepped for washer and dryer we have hot cold water and power in this in this unit in this closet so you got some great options there nice little built-ins on the back uh, here so maybe a place to set water uh, in the evening cell phones and we do have convenient usb charging ports and 110 outlets and an escape window in the back here, and then our roller shades. Speaking of USBs, we got one more set of them up by the bed there. This is a 60 by 80 queen bed. Plenty of room to walk around in here. Something else you don't see in a lot of trailers like this, so we do have a factory max fan in here. So this is a regular vent lid, but this is a max fan. That's not anything too crazy, but it's actually wired into the wall. So you can actually turn that thing on and and get some airflow, suck some air in, uh, move some air out of this thing, and uh, really keep it fresh. So hopefully you guys have really enjoyed walking through the 2023 Puma 26 FKDS. If you have any questions, if I missed anything, please hit them in the comments below. And uh, like and subscribe. We always love to see new subscribers on here and uh, lots, lots more videos to come. So again, I'm Campin' Cass, Smith RV in Casper, Wyoming. We'd love to help. Have a great day. Thanks.